Most of us love sports betting, and obviously one of the most famous Super Bowl props of all time is the Gatorade shower color. Today, we're going to take a quick look at history, and I'll be giving you the answer on what the Gatorade shower is going to be. And when I end up being right, I expect you to subscribe. The Gatorade shower started in 1987 when the Giants beat the Broncos 39-10 in Super Bowl 21. This Gatorade shower is orange, which currently leads the NFL in all-time wins in a post-game Gatorade shower, making five career appearances. None and clear are tied for second with four each. Blue and yellow have three each, and purple has two trips to the Super Bowl. Currently, the odds have orange being the favorite this year. Blue is tied with yellow and green, red and pink follows under, then water, then purple, then none. Now, if you take a look at both teams, they have both won a Super Bowl in the past five years. The Eagles in 2018 dumped yellow, and the Chiefs in 2020 dumped orange. The last two years, the Super Bowl Gatorade color has been blue, so surely it is not going to be blue again. We are going to rule blue out of this equation, especially since none of the teams are correlated to the blue color. I think we could rule out none too, as if the Eagles win, new young coach Nick Sirianni is definitely going to want a Gatorade shower, and that's just a boring pick anyways. Now, if the Chiefs win, will the Chiefs go orange again? Well, if we take a look at head coaches who have won multiple Super Bowls, Bill Belichick has received multiple different colors in blue, yellow, clear, and none. Bill Purcells, the Giants head coach who won two different Super Bowls in the 80s and 90s, received two different colors as well in orange and clear. Tom Coughlin, who won two Super Bowls against the Patriots in the 2000s, received two separate showers as well in clear and purple. The point I'm trying to make is that teams like to capture different moments for their head coaches. So if the Chiefs were to win, I don't think they'll go orange again for Andy Reid. So that leaves us with the options yellow, red, and purple. We're going to remove purple from this situation as it doesn't really happen often. But if we take a look at Philly's history, they gave Doug Peterson a lime Gatorade bath after the NFC Championship versus the Vikings in 2018, and then a lime Gatorade bath following the Super Bowl victory against the Patriots. Last week, Philly also gave Nick Sirianni a lime Gatorade bath following their victory against the 49ers to book a ticket to the Super Bowl. So we see a common theme in Philly here. Green jerseys, green logo, green Gatorade bath. If you believe that Philly is going to win, 100% go with yellow slash lime slash green. On the Chiefs side of the ball, the Chiefs primary color is red. The stadium logo, State Farm, is also red. Mahomes also has a State Farm endorsement. If you think the Chiefs are going to win, I'm telling you, I would pick red, which means my two favorites would be lime slash red, and I'm telling you, it will be one of these colors. Even though I don't want Philadelphia to win, I do think they are going to win, so if I were you, I would pick lime. But again, if you think the Chiefs are going to win, then pick red. Come back to this video on February 13th and you'll see that I'm right.